analysis of you, me, and everyone we know. Right, so the main feature in this is uh, how everyone seems to be connected to each other without really knowing it. Oh, I've just noticed that is. That is oh, sugar. That's not good. Oh dear. My wall's falling apart. Um, right, you, me, and everyone we know. Everyone seems to be connected in some sort of way, an odd way in which you wouldn't really realise it. The oddest of which seems to be between. The, uh, do you know the shoe worker's son, youngest son, and the art director? That is a really creepy relationship. And then you've got... Basically the film is showing how everyone seems to be more connected these days because of technology and... You never know the type of people, the, the people that you're actually connected to through other people. Everyone's, everyone knows each other mutually in some strange way and it's thanks to technology, social media, online chatting websites. Um, again, as mentioned in the Ghost World vlog, which I've just recorded and you may not watch in chronological order, so in which case when I will mention it in the Ghost World vlog, or referencing back in the Ghost World vlog when I mentioned it here, depending on where you're watching it, there's no... I can't see any archetypes, apart from the creepy man who is in that house and wants to, like, have sexual intercourse with those two schoolgirls. That is a bit of a... Well, no, it's not an archetype, it's a stereotype. Well, it's not even that. It's just a creepy old man. I can't see any archetypes in there. I can't see any stereotypes. Um, I mean, they've even got interracial relationship in there. It, it's, it's very modern, it's very real. I, it's, it's different to mainstream cinema. It is different. In... I'm just going to keep mentioning archetypes over and over again if I don't shut myself up. That's actually all I've got to say to on it. And say to you on it. I wear black a lot. Alien.